Hunter conservationists have spearheaded efforts that resulted in the successful reintroduction of wild turkeys in the rugged western mountains. The thriving wild turkey populations made possible by conservation efforts have created new hunting opportunities that were previously non-existent. However, hunting turkeys with a bow in the unpredictable weather and rugged terrain of Central Oregon is no easy feat, and it has become the second year of pursuit for Yogi in an effort to harvest his first wild turkey. For me, it presents another opportunity to hunt this iconic bird species with my bow. Few experiences can match the sense of being inside a hunting cabin, surrounded by memories of past hunts adorning the walls. Each trophy tells a unique story of the rugged western terrain where these majestic animals freely roam. Here, the same habitat that hosts abundant populations of elk and mule deer is also home to wild turkeys. The feeling of anticipation that arises when we finally hold our bows and head afield is something that most hunters can relate to. We are back, Oregon turkey hunting, round two for Yogi. Trying to get him a bird. Last year it was like scorching hot and this year there's still snow on the ground. So, little different program. I brought all of the clothes this time. All of them. Because Mama has to stay warm. Because <laughs> Mama's got to stay warm. That's right. Because it's going to be cold. We're here. That's right. It's up here. He's going to be up first today, but I'm getting prepared just in case because there's always that chance we could pull a double.
he likes this spot. But now he's changing his mind because there's not as much turkey sign. single pin back down to 15 yards for my optimal turkey hunting distance. For hunters, there's something special about returning to the same place year after year. It's not just the thrill of the hunt, but the deep sense of heritage that draws them back. It's the small things that matter. Simply spending time together, barbecuing in camp, to rediscovering the natural beauty of the landscape. For Yogi and I, these mountains have quickly become a treasured place for us to hunt turkey. For the wild turkey, its life comes full circle each year. In the early days of spring, when the birds mate and lay eggs, they ensure a future for the next generation. We love knowing that the young birds that we've passed on in years past have now had a better opportunity for them to live the life they're destined for. As a hunter, witnessing this firsthand enshrines our connection to the stewardship of wildlife. With each step of the hunt, we're reminded of past memories and the promise of new adventure. The familiar sights and sounds of the landscape guide us along the way like old friends pointing a path. These are the moments that my husband and I treasure because we're together, doing what we love, spending time in some of the most beautiful landscapes in the world. When you're on a DIY hunt, you want everything to be perfect, from your setup and location to help increase your chances of success. You're solely responsible for getting everything right. This involves knowing the location of where these wide-ranging birds scratch for food, mill for seeds, chase bugs, and of course, strut for hens. I think we missed like all of the prime time turkey hunting today driving. Yeah, probably. Yeah. And then it hailed. Yeah. Well, as soon as we came in here, that tom was going up the hill towards where they roost and it just hailed and I mean nothing all afternoon but Well and, and also we had a coyote run through this area. And yeah, that thing was going crazy. It did not help us at all. Yeah. Blew out every turkey in the corridor here. Yeah. Not much going on. No, but tomorrow it's supposed to be almost 60, so <laughs> snowing it. today, hopefully <laughs> 60 tomorrow. Yeah, let's hope for the better.
five yards. There's a couple birds out there. They're just outside of range. And they're not really wanting to come in. For many hunters like Yogi, it's not just about the thrill of the chase. It's about respecting the wildlife and having the discipline to pass on a shot that is out of his comfort zone. We had a lot of action here tonight. Um, a lot of rut activity, a couple of uh, strutting birds and gobbling, and there's some beautiful animals. I wanted to take my first turkey with a bow, and they were just not within reach just outside of 45 yards all the time, so I decided to hold off for tonight. Despite the now cold weather, the thrill of setting out decoys and calling to a nearby gobbler is a springtime favorite and a sign that the long winter months are coming to a close. When bow hunting turkeys from a blind, there can be a considerable amount of downtime spent waiting for the perfect opportunity. As the day begins to warm and the woods begin to wake, the sounds that an approaching Tom makes with his wings beating and drumming lets you know that he is close. And there's nothing quite like witnessing a Tom in full display with feathers fluffed in full strut. This is the moment that we have been waiting for. I think he's coming. <laughs> Finally! Yeah, redemption. <laughs> right? Literally. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's awesome. It is. Beautiful bird. Look at the colors on it. Yeah, it's a great hunt. It was pretty cool. It feels like it took the turkeys a couple hours in the morning to get warmed up. And get like, warmed up literally. Before they started, yeah. you know, uh, talking to us. And it's awesome. Thank you. I love you, husband. Love Congratulations. You. Thank you. Ridge off to my left 
we didn't hear a lot of action um, up the canyon otherwise we would have went up to our other stand so we'll give this a shot and if nothing really starts happening and if we hear a bunch of gobbling you know way up high we'll maybe reevaluate um, our setup turkeys gobble in hours and uh, I just think that our time is better spent trying to locate some new birds for tomorrow. It's, oh wait, there's a turkey right there. Oh, To cover the distance between the roost tree and the feeding grounds every day, one must spend a considerable amount of time trekking in search of a boastful gobble. And in that search, one of the most magical aspects of western turkey hunting is the wide variety of wildlife that one encounters while in the field. The excitement of locating the birds on their way back to the roost provides a boost of enthusiasm for the hunt the next day. After days of scouting, trekking the mountain, and patiently waiting in blinds, we celebrated our successes and couldn't help but appreciate the beauty of the rugged mountain terrain and the variety of wildlife that we had encountered along the way. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> the experience of hunting for turkeys in the wild is exhilarating, and we know that we will be back again next year to hunt these intelligent and elusive birds once more. Oh my more. gosh, that's so awesome. My hand is shaking so bad. <laughs> like, look at this beautiful long beard. Wow. The memory of this successful hunt will stay with us forever as a first yogi and a testament to the power of determination, patience, and respect for nature. Hunting is not just about the thrill of the chase or pride of a successful harvest, but also about the connection that we feel to the land and the wildlife that call it home. For more Pursue the Wild, jump behind the scenes with us for our new lifestyle digital series, Our Wild Life. And make sure to tune into our podcast, Wild and Uncut. We appreciate you being part of our journey.